In this video, I will be showing you guys how I got the legendary Fox Lamp Sword in Blocks Fruits. As soon as the update dropped, I got to work to try and figure out how to get the Fox Lamp. But because of school, I couldn't really look into it until I was finished school. First, I went on Discord to look for other people who want to search for the shrine with me. And these are the teammates I ended up with. Next, I figured out how to get the new C event soon enough thanks to the Blocks Fruits wiki. Then we ventured out into the sea and searched for the Shrine C event. There were many annoying pests like the sharks and piranhas. Someone on our team suggested that we should use two boats, just in case one broke midway. Which was pretty smart, but we came at the right timing when the full moon appeared. So we didn't really need two boats. Luckily, we got the Kitsune Island right away. So we went to the statue to get the quest. Now, we can just go hunt for Azure Embers. I used the Buddha fruit because it's the easiest way to get them. I kind of panicked at first because I didn't see any flying around. But then I found my first one, so I rushed at it like a dog in the Pavlov experiment. Because I was that excited for to get the new items. As the blue moon was beginning to fade, I made sure I got 25 azure embers. Now, it was the moment of truth. Will I get the fox lamp or not? Woo! At that moment, I was very excited. Excited to test it out. Excited to level it up. And excited to post a video about it. And of course, I had to let everyone know I got the fox lamp on my first try. And then I thought that if they got more Azure Embers, I could get more stuff. But now, that I think about it, it was pretty dumb of me to think that. And of course, I have to take this screenshot of the island to put in my thumbnail. The lightning made it hard to go high in the air, but I managed to do it. Thank you guys for watching, and be sure to watch my other videos as well. Bye!